A growing trend in schools throughout the country looks to be making its way to school districts right here in Texoma. Yeah, Curtis Jackson spoke with a couple of superintendents today about going to a four day school week. And so, Curtis, one district here has already started that schedule. Yeah, while several schools in Texoma are considering the four day switch, Petrolia CISD began a four day school week starting in February. And Superintendent David Hedges says he's already noticed positive effects on not only the students, but with the staff as well. I know from polling the teachers, they like it. You know, it's been a re good, good recruitment tool for us. For a little over two months now, students in Petrolia CISD have been attending school Monday through Thursday instead of the typical five day school week, something Superintendent David Hedges says is already paying off. We run um, eight bus routes every day, twice a day. So if we can cut back one day a week, for a couple weeks a year, that, that's a huge saving for us, not to mention electricity and water. Besides saving funds, Hedges says he's noticed a difference in his staff and the students. It's hard to get a, get a lot out of them on Friday because they are so worn down. And so this gives them a little bit of a break to, to catch back up and have that three day weekend. It seems like they're able to pay more attention Monday through Thursday. Hedges says due to testing, they will begin five day weeks again in May. And although several schools are considering this option, Superintendent of Archer City ISD, CD Knobloch, says he believes five day school weeks are the way to go. I think it's more important to have our kids here five days a week. They get to fed five days per week. And uh, if we were to cut that down to four days, you know, that would be another day that they wouldn't be here with us. And I'm not saying that, you know, a four day week's not better for another community. I'm, I'm certainly not against it. And students relying on school meals was one of the first things that crossed Hedges' mind, which is why his staff created a program to help make up for that meal they might miss by not being in school. We send home what we call power packs, but we send home food on Thursdays so they'll have food throughout the weekend. Uh, till they come back on Monday. Hedges says he'll be sending out a survey in the next week or two to the parents to get their feedback, which could result in four day weeks full time. Now Hedges says going to a four day week has also allowed his staff to catch up on work that they may sometimes have to rush through over the weekend. Now when I asked Knobloch if he would consider the schedule change further down the road, he said he would. He would just like to see more data first. He mentioned it would be a great recruiting tool. I can yeah. imagine that it would be. For sure. <laughs> okay, Curtis, thank you very much. Now in our area, Prairie Valley also does a four-day week, and it's a four-and-a-half-day week in Nakona. Montague will begin a four-day school week starting in the fall.